This question is about sort of just more general patterns. Um, they give you some diagrams here and they talk about the rows and the columns. And so just to make sure we're clear here, what do we mean by rows and columns? These right here, those are rows. So in other words, this first one right here, we have, um, well, we could say there's two rows. And here we could say there's one column. Okay, it's just me saying COL for column. So that's this. So it's a number of columns. The way I remember it is imagine if you have a building, you know, lots of buildings have columns, you know, holding up, let's say, a roof. Well, the columns are things that stand straight up and down. So that's how I remember columns. For example, this one here has two columns. And this one here has three columns and four columns and so on. And this is number of rows here. It's one, two, three, four, five rows, for example. And so on. So let's look at this then. They tell us drawing number five. What does it have? They say it has P rows, that's the number of rows, and Q columns. Well, if you look from one of these to the next iteration, do you notice what happens with the rows? To get number two, you have to add one more row and add one more column, and then add one more on top of that to get number three, and add one more and one more. So in other words, to get to this one right here, well, it's gonna have one more row. So if this one here had five rows, this one has six rows. And if this one here has four columns, this one here has five columns. And this is all you have to do. It's actually that easy. So P, since it's a number of rows, P is just six. And Q is a number of columns, so that's just five. So Q, oops, equals five. That's it. Those are some easy marks, if you understood the diagram then. I think what's difficult about this question is just getting through the notation of what they use for P's and Q's and later on with things like K. Once you sort of figure that out, you decode it, then the rest of the question isn't actually as bad as it seems.